Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I want to make a video about the interactive fill tool and some things you can think about. It actually works as a transparency tool. Also, if you go to the interactive fill, you don't have a color selected yet, and we're just going to go from one side to the other. It's going to default to gray. This color can automatically be changed by just clicking that color. To change this color, you've got to click on this and then click on the red. Then you can always you know, change your slide bar. But right here is kind of the key. This is your transparency active fill without using the transparency docker. We can make this whole thing a little lighter and it's almost transparent. Well, it is transparent. We're gonna to go to object order, put this in the back of the page and you can see that it's still dark blue but as we get it behind the transparency and the, and the interactive feel that we've changed. Now, what's so good about it, you can always go back to the interactive feel and add to it and change it up a little bit. Change your colors to red and change your transparency to maybe not quite as transparent. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.